Hello my dear friends, welcome back to Infigyan. In this video, we have one very very interesting rational equation problem which we will be solving for the real values of x. So let's get started by writing our denominators cannot be 0. So I can write 3x plus 6 can't be 0. So x cannot be equal to minus 2 and 2x plus 6 can't be 0. So x cannot be minus 3. Now I will take 3 common from here and 2 common from here. So I will write 1 over 3 cube times x plus 3 over 3 was common in the bracket we can write x plus 2 whole cube plus 1 over 2 is common so 2 cube will come out times x plus 2 over x plus 3 whole cube equal to half. Now I will multiply our equation by 6 cube both sides. So let me write here 6 cube. Here also 6 cube. Here also 6 cube. So I can write here 6 over 3 whole cube times x plus 3 over x plus 2 whole cube plus 6 over 2 whole cube times x plus 2 over x plus 3 whole cube. And 6 cube is 216 divided by 2. So RHS will be 108. Now 6 over 3 is 2 and 6 over 2 is 3. So I can write here this is 2 cube times x plus 3 over x plus 2 whole cube plus 6 over 2 is 3. So 3 cube times x plus 2 over x plus 3 whole cube equal to 108. Now I will take this 2 cube in the bracket. So I can write our equation 2x plus 6 over x plus 2 whole cube plus 3 cube we will take in the bracket so it will come in as 3. So 3 times x is 3x, 3 times 2 is 6 over x plus 3 whole cube equal to 108. Now this is our equation. Let me write our equation here. Here it is. Now we can use substitution. Let me call this is a. And this bracket we will consider B. So the very first equation which we can write from here will be A cube plus B cube equal to 108. Now we will calculate A times B. So let me write here A times B. This will be equal to 2x plus 6 over x plus 2 times 3x plus 6 over x plus 3 or we can write 2 times x plus 3 over x plus 2 times 3 is common in bracket x plus 2 over x plus 3. Now you can see x plus 3, x plus 3, x plus 2 and x plus 2 from numerator and denominator will get over we will get 2 times 3, 6. So A times B is 6. And this equation we will consider equation 2. Now we have to solve these two equations. AB equal to 6. AQ plus BQ equal to 108. Let's write here. AQ plus BQ equal to 108 and AB equal to 6. Now I will assume 
a plus b suppose this is t now i can write algebraic formula a plus b whole cube this will be equal to a cube plus b cube plus 3 times ab times a plus b now a plus b is t so we will write t cube in lhs a cube plus b cube is 108 plus 3 times ab is 6 a plus b is our substitution t so i can write t cube will be equal to 108 plus 3 times 6 18 it is 18 t or i can write cubic equation as t cube minus 18t minus 108 equal to 0. Now equation is cubic. I will use method of factorization. Let me write equation here. t cube minus 18t minus 108 equal to 0. Now I will split our middle term minus 18t as t cube minus 36t plus 18t. So minus 36 plus 18 is minus 18, minus 108 equal to 0. Now t is looking common from first two terms. So t square minus 36 plus 18 is common from last two. So I will write here t minus 6. 108 over 18 is 6 equal to 0. Or we can write t times t square minus 6 square. So we can apply difference of two squares formula. So we will be getting t plus 6 times t minus 6 plus 18 times t minus 6 equal to 0. Now we can take t minus 6 common. In the bracket, we will get t times t plus 6, which will give us t square plus 60 plus 18 equal to 0. From here, I can use product 0 rule. So we can write either t minus 6 will be 0 or this quadratic expression t square plus 60 plus 18 will be 0. So from our first equation t minus 6 equal to 0, we can conclude t will be equal to 6. And t was our substitution a plus b. So I can write here a plus b equal to 6. Now our a times b was 6 also. So I will write one equation. Let me write here a plus 6 equal to 6, a times b equal to 6. This is one system which we will be solving. Now we will take that second quadratic equation t square plus 60 plus 18 equal to 0. Now I will find out the value of discriminant only. Discriminant is equal to b square minus 4ac. So b is coefficient of t. I will write 6 square minus 4 times 1 times 18. Now 6 square is 36. 4 times 18 is 72. So we will be getting minus 36. Discriminant is coming out negative. So we will get complex solutions. Complex solutions. So this quadratic we can reject as we are looking for real solutions. Now for this system of equation, I will calculate from the first equation the value of b. b will be 6 minus a which we will apply here. So I can write a times 6 minus a equal to 6 or 6a 
minus a square equal to 6. Multiply this equation by negative 1. We will get a square minus 6a equal to minus 6. Let me write equation here. a square minus 6a equal to negative 6. Now I will add 9 to both sides. Plus 9. Here also we will add 9. Now in LHS this is one perfect square. This is a minus 3 whole square. In RHS 9 minus 6 is 3. Now we can take a square root both sides. We will get a minus 3 equal to plus minus a square root 3. Add 3 to both sides. We will get values of a. So we can write 3 plus minus a square root 3. Or I can write 2 values. 3 plus a square root 3 and 3 minus a square root 3. But this is the value of a. We have to find the value of x. So if I will write our substitution a, a was 2x plus 6 over x plus 2 equal to 3 minus root 3. This was our substitution if you remember. Now I will consider 2 common out or let us consider a here and simplify or solve for the value of x. Let, let us do like this 2x plus 6 over x plus 2 equal to a. Cross multiply 2x plus 6 equal to ax plus 2a. Or we can write 6 minus 2a. This will be equal to x is common in the bracket a minus 2. So here we are getting x in terms of a. 6 minus 2a over a minus 2. Now we have two values of a. If I will write 3 plus root 3. And second was 3 minus root 3. So let us calculate x1 with a equal to 3 plus root 3. Let me write here x1 equal to 6 minus 2 times 3 plus root 3 over 3 plus root 3 minus 2. Now I have to simplify numerator 6 minus 6 minus 2 root 3 over 3 minus 2 is 1. So 1 plus root 3. Now plus 6 and minus 6 will be over. We will get x1 equal to minus 2 square root 3 over 1 plus square root 3. Now we will rationalize our denominator. So here I will multiply with 1 minus root 3 in the numerator and in the denominator. Now you can see 1 plus root 3 times 1 minus root 3 will give us denominator 1 minus 3 which will be minus 2. So I will get here root 3 times 1 minus root 3 or I can write root 3 minus 3. This is our first solution x1 equal to root 3 minus 3. Now I will write x equal to 6 minus 2a over a minus 2. Now I will apply a equal to 3 minus root 3. So 6 minus 2 times 3 minus root 3 over 3 minus root 3 minus 2. Let's simplify. We will get x2. 
सिक्स माइनस सिक्स प्लस टू स्क्वायर रूट थ्री दिस विल बी न्यूमरेटर डिनोमिनेटर विल बी थ्री माइनस टू इज वन माइनस रूट थ्री प्लस सिक्स माइनस सिक्स विल बी कैंसल्ड आउट विल गेट टू स्क्वायर रूट थ्री ओवर वन माइनस स्क्वायर रूट थ्री अगेन आई विल रेशनलाइज अवर डिनोमिनेटर सो आई विल मल्टीप्लाई वन प्लस रूट थ्री इन द न्यूमिनेटर एंड इन द डिनोमिनेटर अगेन विल गेट ए माइनस बी टाइम से प्लस बी फॉर्म इन द डिनोमिनेटर वी विल गेट वन स्क्वायर माइनस रूट थ्री स्क्वायर इज थ्री सो दिस विल गिव अस वन माइनस थ्री सो अगेन डिनोमिनेटर विल बी माइनस टू सो आई कैन राइट एक्स टू एज अ सिंप्लीफाइड फॉर्म टू स्क्वायर रूट थ्री वन प्लस स्क्वायर रूट थ्री ओवर माइनस टू और आई कैन राइट माइनस स्क्वायर रूट थ्री टाइम्स वन प्लस स्क्वायर रूट थ्री और वी कैन राइट माइनस स्क्वायर रूट थ्री माइनस थ्री दिस इज अवर सेकेंड सोल्यूशन और सेकेंड आंसर इफ आई विल राइट अवर फाइनल आंसर देन एक्स विल बी इक्वल टू रूट थ्री माइनस थ्री एंड माइनस रूट थ्री माइनस थ्री I hope friends you will like this video thank you so very much for watching do not forget to like share and subscribe bye bye till next video good luck take care goodbye